This sucks. Yeah, our job kind of sucked ass, dude. You're telling me. Charlie. Yeah, man, you look like total shit. Really? What happened, man? What the hell is going on? Why are our dads getting so drunk? God damn it! Okay, students, today we're going to continue our study on economics. You see, economics is a social science concerned with the factors that determine. Dude, what are we going to do? Our dads are endangering themselves! Maybe we should take their booze away. What the f are you doing back there? Are you trying to sabotage my class? Yes, Mr. Edward. Goddamn kids. So, anyway, as I was saying, children, economics is a very important part of your life that you really need to know about. Because if you don't know about economics, you become a fag. And if you come, become a fag, you will not get hired by anybody. Oh, God damn it! Oh, sweet! I love this episode! A wow, I'm not a thousand way. I know it, so you don't have to. And today I'm going to be reviewing this is What up, guys? It's just, I'm gonna go in the back and drink some of my beer, so just don't follow me, alright? Dad, get the fuck back here now! What are you doing, you little bitch? I don't like it when you get very drunk, Dad. Listen, I'm fine. Why don't you just go leave me alone, son? Piss off, you little perv. Sorry, but your dad is intoxicated. God damn it! What are we gonna do? I know, Alec Baldwin's not dubbing Thomas anymore. Charlie, what does this have to do with anything? Fine, how about George Carlin dubbing him? Alright, seriously, enough with the references! Can't we just hide their d d What, what do you mean? All we have to do, guys, is just hide our parents' boots in the forest. This is ridiculous, Charlie, how are we gonna pull that off? Charlie's right, Jack. We have to do it. It is the only way to save our game. This is just the stupidest shit. If we sneak out tomorrow after school, we'll be able to hide their boots. Stop being a jackass. Just do it during school, bro. Ditching school? Are you retarded? Look, if you want your dad to come home drunk every night, then be my guest. Jesus Christ, just shut up and do it already, guys. That's right, I'll do it. But if we get busted, I'm blaming you, Charlie. I'm willing to take a risk. Godworm? What the fuck are you talking about? Dude, you're being overdramatic! Stop! Whatever. You haven't seen anything yet. Ugh. What the hell is wrong with you, dude? What the? Mordecai! Hello there, guys. What's up, Charlie? What did you do to my drink? Where's my milk? Oh, there's no milk. All the milk containers have been replaced with alcohol. Sick. That is messed up, man.
what is it, Dad? Have you seen my food? Uh, Dad. No, Dad. Uh, sorry. Um, I don't know. Uh, the FCC took it away. Took away the bones. Oh my God! I gotta check it the paper. Did you tell them about the FCC joke? Yeah, I did. Eat the boy, dude. Meet us at the woods in half an hour and bring the booze. I got him in a big bag upstairs in my room. I'll meet you there at 8.30 sharp. Chris, where the hell are you going? You have to help me find my booze! Sorry, Ted. I'm going to the park to play basketball or something. Charlie, did you bring the alcohol or not? Yeah, we got all of our parents' booze. Fortunately, Morgan over here showed up late. Where are you, damn it? Haven't you stuck to the truck? No, you don't. You live right across from me. All right, all right, just start digging. So what are you here for, Mr. Montague? Well, I was called in here because our boy said they wanted an intervention. Intervention. Why the hell do we have to get an intervention for us? We have no problem. Uh, guys, we need to talk to you. You're the one that has a problem. Charles Xavier. Look, guys, we are really worried about you. And you should take the time of your life to do something with it, not wait to eat the turkey, not don't take your lives. You know what I've learned? You just have to spend some time with your lives actually doing something, and rather than just wasting it, like with drinking. And then you'll learn that life isn't so bad after all. Yeah, and if you ruin your lives by drinking nonstop, we'll have to talk about nothing all about how our dads are just nothing but alcoholic fags who have no lives. Yeah, they're right. Let's not waste our lives by getting drunk. Yeah, let's go to a strip club instead. Wait, what? Yeah, strip club! That's not what I- Ah, uh, screw this. Well, I guess our dads are not going to win anything. You're damn right they're not. Why the hell did we agree to do this anyway? So what do you want to do? You guys up for a match first? Yeah, okay. Nice! I get to use the duel this first! No! I want it! Get back here! Yo, what up, Charlie? Oh. Hey, bro. You know, there's been a couple of weird things happening these past few days. You know what? I don't want to think about those things anymore, Charlie. Our dads aren't going to learn shit. I guess they went to the strip club again. Nope, they're not gonna go back there for a while. Why? You don't need to know, Charlie. You don't need to know. Last night I saw this strange kid with red scars on his face. Just running through the guards for some reason. It's like, I don't know what the heck this kid's up to, but I have a weird feeling about this. Oh, Charlie, what a queer lord of words you just put in my ears.